ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the star of our show, Terry. Hey there, music lovers. Welcome back to another episode of The Music and Me. I'm Terry, your host, and today I'm beyond thrilled to dive into the world of one of my all-time favorite girl groups, the legendary Spice Girls. Yep, you heard me right. From their catchy girl power anthems to those dance floor fillers that still get us grooving, the Spice Girls have left an unforgettable mark on pop culture, and I can't wait to reminisce about it with all of you. As a diehard fan who still dreams of singing Zig a Zig Ah, this episode holds a special place in my heart. But before we jump into the spice-tacular adventure ahead, I've got a little request. If you're loving the vibes here on The Music and Me, hit that subscribe button and spread the word to your fellow Spice Girls enthusiasts. Sharing is caring, and trust me, there's plenty of girl power to go around. So buckle up, because we're about to embark on a journey filled with nostalgia, empowerment, and maybe even a sprinkle of zig zig ah Let's infuse some spice into your life right here, right now. Are you ready? Let's do this then. For those of you who have been living under a pop culture resistant rock, allow me to introduce you to the legendary Spice Girls. Imagine a whirlwind of sass, style, and sisterhood crashing onto the music scene in the mid-1990s. That's right. We're talking about scary, sporty, baby, ginger, and posh, five fierce femmes who took the world by storm with their infectious energy and empowering anthems. From their debut single, Wannabe, which skyrocketed to the top of the charts worldwide, to their bold fashion choices and iconic catchphrases like girl power, the Spice Girls weren't just a girl group, they were a cultural revolution. So, if you haven't experienced the joy of zig zig eyeing with the Spice Girls, buckle up and get ready for a ride filled with glitter, giggles, and plenty of girl power. First, let's embark on the spicy saga of how the Spice Girls came to be. Picture the vibrant landscape of the 1990s where a musical revolution shimmered, soon to explode onto the scene in the form of the Spice Girls. But how did this iconic quintet of fierce femininity ascend to the summits of both the charts and our affections? It all begins in 1994, a pivotal year in pop music history, and also a pivotal year in my history. That's the year I graduated high school. So that's how old I am. Enter Bob Herbert and his son Chris Herbert, armed with a visionary concept. They boldly planted an advertisement in the stage beckoning forth all audacious young women that basically said, Attention all cool chicks, we're concocting the next pop sensation, and we want you. A tidal wave of talent and ambition surged forth from every corner of the kingdom. Aspiring songstresses descended upon auditions, exuding confidence and pouring their hearts into performances as if vying for the concert of the century. Yet, It wasn't merely about assembling five vocally gifted individuals. It was about curating a harmonious blend of personalities. Destiny intervened, and thus, the Spice Girls were forged. From the inception of auditions, it was evident that these young women possessed an overwhelming magic. There was Scary, commanding attention with her bold persona and penchant for leopard print. Sporty brought athleticism and powerhouse vocals to the ensemble while Baby enchanted all with her infectious energy and sweet smile. Ginger turned heads with her fiery demeanor and iconic Union Jack dresses, while Posh exuded elegance and sophistication unmatched by any. Following what must have felt like the ultimate showdown of vocal prowess, the Spice Girls emerged triumphant. Girl power forever. All right. Let me introduce you to the fabulous members of the one and only Spice Girls. First up, we've got Victoria Beckham, or back then she was Victoria Adams, a.k.a. Posh Spice. From the moment she strutted onto the pop scene with her sleek bob and killer fashion sense, Victoria became synonymous with sophistication and style. But how did she earn the coveted title of Posh Spice? Well, it all started with a nickname. Legend has it that during the early days of the Spice Girls, Victoria was dubbed posh by a British tabloid newspaper. 
The name stuck, and soon, Victoria fully embraced her posh persona, bringing a touch of class and elegance to the group. But Posh Spice was more than just a name. She was an integral part of the Spice Girls' success. With her smooth vocal harmonies and effortless stage presence, Victoria added a layer of sophistication to the group's dynamic sound. Whether she was striking a pose or belting out a ballad, Posh Spice commanded attention with her undeniable charisma. Even though Victoria Beckham bid adieu to her Spice Girls days, her journey was far from reaching its end. Transitioning from pop star to fashion mogul, she delved into the realm of fashion, establishing herself as a celebrated designer and style icon. With sleek tailored suits and chic dresses, Victoria's fashion label embodies modern elegance and timeless sophistication. So whether she's dominating the charts or the runway, there's no denying that Victoria Beckham, also known as Posh Spice, remains a formidable force. From her beginnings as a pop sensation to her evolution into a multifaceted icon, Victoria exemplifies true versatility and influence in every sense of the word. Next, let's shine the spotlight on Melanie Brown, better known as the one and only Scary Spice. From the moment she burst onto the scene with her fearless attitude and fierce energy, Mel B earned her iconic moniker in a way that was as unforgettable as it was fitting. But why scary, you ask? Well, it all boils down to Mel B's larger-than-life personality and unapologetic confidence. With her bold fashion choices, wild curls, and no-nonsense attitude, she wasn't afraid to push the boundaries and challenge the status quo. Whether she was belting out powerhouse vocals or commanding the stage with her electrifying performances, Mel B exuded a sense of fearlessness that earned her the admiration of fans worldwide. But Scary Spice was more than just a name. She was the heart and soul of the Spice Girls. With her powerful vocals and infectious energy, Mel B brought a whole lot of sass to the group's dynamic sound. From the feisty lyrics of Wannabe to the anthemic Spice Up Your Life, she was the driving force behind some of the group's most memorable hits. And while her time as a Spice Girl may have come to an end, Mel B's star continues to shine bright. From music to television, she dabbled in a variety of ventures, including serving as a judge on talent shows like America's Got Talent. But no matter where her career takes her, one thing's for sure, Mel B will always be remembered as the fearless, fiery force known as Scary Spice. And she's one of my favorites. Now, let's turn our attention to the delightful Emma Bunton, affectionately known as Baby Spice. From the moment she graced the stage with her sweet smile and bubbly personality, Emma captured the hearts of fans around the world and earned her adorable nickname in the most endearing way possible. But how did she become Baby Spice? Well, it all started with Emma's infectious charm and youthful exuberance. With her signature blonde pigtails, cute dresses, and sugary sweet vocals, she embodied the innocence and joy that fans couldn't help but adore. Whether she was delivering heartwarming harmonies or charming audiences with her adorable antics, Emma brought a sense of childlike wonder to the group that was simply irresistible. But Baby Spice was more than just a name. She was the embodiment of pure joy and positivity. From the uplifting melodies of Say You'll Be There to the whimsical vibes of Two Become One, Emma's sugary sweet vocals added an extra layer of magic to the Spice Girls' iconic sound. Even though Emma has moved on from her days as a Spice Girl, her career has only blossomed further. With successful solo albums and ventures in television and radio hosting, she showcased her versatility and authenticity. Whether she's belting out tunes, charming audiences on screen, or simply spreading joy wherever she goes, Baby Spice will forever hold a cherished spot in our hearts. I loved Baby Spice. She was so sweet. Kind of like me. Or how I used to be. I mean, I'm still sweet. All right. Let's turn our attention to the dynamic Melanie Chisel, better known as the incomparable Sporty Spice. From the moment she stepped onto the scene with her athletic prowess and powerhouse vocals, 
Mel C. earned her rightful title as Sporty Spice in a way that embodied strength, determination, and pure talent. But why sporty, you might wonder? Well, it all began with Mel C.'s undeniable athleticism and boundless energy. With her love for sports and penchant for rocking athletic wear, she embodied a sense of strength and athleticism that set her apart from the rest. Whether she was belting out high notes or busting out backflips on stage, Mel C.'s dynamic performances showcased her versatility and commitment to excellence. She was the powerhouse behind some of the Spice Girls' most electrifying moments. From the energetic beats of Spice Up Your Life to the anthemic wannabe, Mel C.'s incredible range and dynamic vocals added an extra layer of depth and excitement to the group's iconic sound. Even though Mel C. has moved on from her days as a Spice Girl, her star still burns brightly. With numerous successful solo albums and a string of electrifying performances worldwide, she's established herself as a formidable presence in the music industry. Whether she's hitting high notes on stage or hitting the gym, Sporty Spice remains a constant source of inspiration for fans everywhere. Also, side note, last week was my Jesus Christ Superstar episode, and Mel C. was actually Mary Magdalene in one of the versions that I've seen. So she even does theater. She's awesome. She was she was always one of my favorites, too. I just liked it because she wore, like, casual clothes and comfortable clothes, things that I would wear. Last, but certainly not least, we turn our attention to the vivacious Jerry Hallowell, also known as the unforgettable Ginger Spice. From the moment she strutted onto the stage with her fiery personality and bold fashion choices, Jerry earned her spicy nickname in a way that embodied confidence, charisma, and undeniable flair. But why Ginger, you might ask? Well, it all began with Jerry's striking red hair, which not only turned heads, but also symbolized her fiery spirit and unapologetic individuality. With her bold fashion statements and fearless attitude, she brought a sense of confidence and sass to the group that was impossible to ignore. She was the heart and soul of the Spice Girls. With her distinctive voice and magnetic stage presence, Jerry played a pivotal role in shaping the group's sound and image. Whether she was belting out anthems like To Become One or stilling the spotlight with her iconic Union Jack dress, Jerry's presence was always felt and never forgotten. Even though her time as a Spice Girl has passed, her star still shines brightly. She's ventured into solo music, penned children's books, and even graced talent show judging panels, proving her versatility and talent time and time again. Whether she's belting out tunes, crafting stories, or simply being her fabulous self, Ginger Spice remains an enduring inspiration to fans worldwide. From the time I um, learned of the Spice Girls, Ginger Spice was always my favorite. I do not know why. I think it was because of her red hair, and I always wanted red hair. I love red hair. But now, Mel B is my favorite. I mean, I love Mel B. I watch her on America's Got Talent, like, all the time. I love her. She's hilarious. Together, these five incredible women made history as the Spice Girls, spreading their message of girl power and friendship far and wide. Though their paths may have diverged, their legacy lives on, reminding us to embrace unity, individuality, and to always spice up our lives. All right, fasten your seatbelts and prepare for a wild ride through the Spice Girls' meteoric rise to fame. Picture it, London, 1994. The air was buzzing with excitement, and the streets were pulsating with the rhythm of a musical revolution. In the midst of the Britpop explosion and grunge gritty rebellion, a different kind of storm was brewing. And at the eye of this glittery hurricane were five fabulous women destined to shake up the world of pop music like never before. Sporty Spice, Baby Spice, Scary Spice, Ginger Spice, and Posh Spice were like a dream team assembled from the stars themselves. From the moment they unleashed their debut single, Wannabe, upon the world in 1996, the Spice Girls became a force to be reckoned with. 
that infectious chorus of if you want to be my lover, you got to get with my friends was like a mantra for a generation, echoing in the hearts and minds of fans across 37 countries. Suddenly, everyone wanted a slice of the Spice Girls magic and who could blame them? But it wasn't just their catchy tunes that catapulted them to stardom. It was their larger than life personas that truly set them apart. Scary brought the sass. Sporty brought the athleticism, Baby brought the sweetness, Ginger brought the fiery spirit, and Posh brought the sophistication, not to mention those killer fashion ensembles that had everyone drooling. Their debut album, Spice, was like a sonic boom heard round the world, selling over 31 million copies and turning them into bona fide pop royalty. Hits like Say You'll Be There and To Become One further solidified their place in music history while their eccentric fashion sense and catchy catchphrases, seriously, who could forget Zigga Zigga, turned them into style icons for an entire generation. And then there was the Spice World Tour, a whirlwind adventure that took them to packed stadiums across the globe. From London to Los Angeles, Tokyo to Toronto, they dazzled audiences with their high-energy performances and infectious charm spreading their message of empowerment and unity wherever they went. But let's face it, when the Spice Girls said girl power, they meant it. But alas, all things must come to an end. After Jerry's departure in 1998, the group soldiered on for a while before ultimately going their separate ways in 2000. Yet their legacy lives on, as vibrant and powerful as ever. From reunion tours to a Broadway musical, the Spice Girls continue to inspire new generations of fans to spice up their lives and embrace their inner girl power. So, here's to the Spice Girls, the ultimate pop sensation who showed us all that with a little bit of attitude and a whole lot of girl power, anything is possible. Zig zig ah, indeed. The Spice Girls didn't just add flavor to our lives, they instilled us in a belief in the potency of friendship, fierceness, and an irresistible pop hook. Okay, in the second half of this episode, we are going to talk about the Spice Girls movie and then their music. So stay tuned, everybody. Welcome to my interesting fact of the week. Hold on to your hats because I've got a tale that'll add some serious flavor to your day. Before the Spice Girls became the queens of girl power, they went by the name Touch. Not exactly as catchy, but hey, we all have to start somewhere, right? Now, picture this. Victoria, Mel B, Emma, Jerry, and Mel C were strutting their stuff as Touch, doing their thing, making music, and dreaming big. But then they decided it was time for a shakeup. New management, new vibe, new everything. Enter Jerry Halliwell, the ultimate spice of life in the group. Rumor has it, she's the brains behind one of the most iconic names in pop music history. But here's the kicker. The name Spice Girls wasn't just plucked out of thin air. Nope, it had some serious flavor behind it. See, the girls had this tune called Sugar and Spice, and let me tell you, it was sweeter than your grandma's apple pie. It celebrated their diverse personalities, each one bringing their own unique flavor to the mix, just like spices in a recipe. And voila, the name Spice Girls was born, just like a burst of flavor exploding in your mouth. Armed with their new name, the Spice Girls didn't just rebrand, they reinvented themselves. Suddenly, they weren't just a girl group, they were a cultural tsunami, spreading girl power like confetti and inspiring millions worldwide. These girls weren't just making music, they were making history. Their tunes were infectious, their style was iconic, and their attitude was unstoppable. They didn't just spice up our lives, they set the whole world on fire. And that, my friends, is how five ordinary girls became the almighty seasoned ones, the Spice Girls. So, next time you're feeling blue, remember a little spice makes everything nice. And now, back to our episode. Welcome back, everybody. 
I hope you enjoyed that interesting fact. I have a great time making those. All right, let's turn our attention to one of my all-time favorite topics, Spice World, the movie. You know, I love this movie so much that I practically wore out my VHS copy. Yes, that's right. I had it on VHS. I actually still have it on VHS. But here's the kicker. Despite my undying love for it, finding a way to watch it again has proven to be more challenging than trying to teach a cat to moonwalk. Seriously, it's like trying to track down a unicorn in the wild. Whether it's not available in my area, or the DVDs are priced higher than a concert ticket to see the actual Spice Girls in concert, which would be awesome, getting my hands on a copy has been a quest worthy of an epic adventure. You can watch clips of it on YouTube, but I really want to watch just the whole movie, you know, from start to finish. But fear not, fellow fans, because even if I can't watch it right this moment, the memories of Spice World will forever live on in my heart. So grab your nostalgia goggles and get ready to reminisce as we delve into the wonderful world of Spice World, the movie. Released in 1997. This musical comedy extravaganza stars none other than our favorite girl group, the Spice Girls, and it's a wild ride from start to finish. The plot? Well, let's just say it's as delightfully chaotic as you'd expect from the Spice Girls. The film follows the girls as they navigate their hectic lives as pop superstars, from rehearsals to photo shoots to glamorous events and spontaneous adventures. Along the way, they encounter a colorful cast of characters, including their overworked manager, their eccentric filmmaker, a pregnant friend in need of a lift to the hospital, and even aliens, which is my favorite part, by the way. But Spice World isn't just about the plot. It's about the pure joy of being a Spice Girl. From the infectious energy of their performances to the hilarious banter between the girls, the film captures the essence of what made the Spice Girls so special. And let's not forget about the catchy tunes that will have you dancing in your seat. As for a reception, Spice World was a hit with fans and critics alike, earning praise for its humor, charm, and unapologetic celebration of girl power. And while it may not have been an Oscar contender, which it should have been in my opinion, it certainly left its mark on popular culture, becoming a beloved cult classic that continues to delight audiences to this day. But perhaps the best part of Spice World is the plethora of memorable moments and cameo appearances. From Elton John to Bob Hoskins, the film is chock full of surprise guests who add an extra layer of fun to the proceedings. And who could forget that iconic bus chase scene, complete with exploding fruit and a very confused Elton John. So whether you're a diehard Spice Girls fan or just in the mood for some feel-good fun, Spice World the movie is guaranteed to spice up your movie night and leave you shouting girl power louder than ever before. If you can find it, let me know, because I really, really want to watch this movie. Even more so now that I talked about it. All right, next up on our Spice Girls extravaganza, let's dive into the heart and soul of their musical empire, their iconic songs. Picture this, you're blasting your favorite 90s tunes and suddenly the unmistakable beats of Wannabe fill the air. Instantly, you're transported back to a time when girl power reigned supreme and Zig Zig Oz echoed across the globe. But Wannabe is just the tip of the iceberg when it comes to the Spice Girls musical legacy. From the infectious energy of Spice Up Your Life to the empowering anthem Say You'll Be There, each song is a vibrant celebration of friendship, empowerment, and of course, girl power. Whether you're belting out Stop at the top of your lungs or getting down to Who Do You Think You Are, the Spice Girls discography is a treasure trove of feel-good hits that never fail to get you groovy. But it's not just about catchy tunes and killer dance moves. There's a deeper message behind the music. With lyrics that champion self-confidence, individuality, and female solidarity, the Spice Girls were more than just a pop group. They were a voice for a generation. They showed us that it's okay to be ourselves, to stand up for what we believe in, and to embrace the power of friendship. And the impact of their music? Let's just say it's nothing short of legendary. 
from sold out stadium tours to chart topping albums, the Spice Girls took the world by storm and left an indelible mark on pop culture. They paved the way for future girl groups and pop acts, inspiring a new generation of artists to follow in their fabulous footsteps. So, as we bask in the glow of their glittering discography, let's raise a glass to the Spice Girls and the timeless music that continues to spice up our lives. After all, as they so famously declared, friendship never ends, and neither does the magic of their music. You know, just a side note, the um, inspiration for this episode came when I was at work and Wannabe came on the radio, and I was like, Spice Girls need an episode. So that's where that came from. So thank you, Work Radio. Next, I'm going to dive deep into some of my all-time favorite Spice Girls songs and share what they mean to me. From the infectious energy of Wannabe to the empowering anthem of Spice Up Your Life, each track holds a special place in my heart. So grab your platform shoes and get ready to spice up your life with me as we explore the magic behind those iconic tunes. First up, we have my absolute favorite Spice Girls song. Too Much is a sublime blend of soulful harmonies, infectious rhythms, and poignant lyrics that resonate deeply with listeners. From the moment the opening notes drift in, it's impossible not to be drawn into its captivating melody. The song's message, which touches on themes of love, longing, and the complexities of relationships, adds an extra layer of depth and emotion to the already enchanting composition. What makes Too Much even more special to me is its association with the Spice Girls movie, where it serves as the opening number setting the stage for a whirlwind adventure filled with friendship, empowerment, and plenty of unforgettable moments. Singing along to Too Much feels like stepping into a time machine, whisking me back to the excitement and nostalgia of that cinematic experience. It's a song that holds a timeless appeal, effortlessly transporting me to a world where anything is possible and where the power of music reigns supreme. Next, let's talk about another iconic Spice Girls song that never fails to get me moving, Spice Up Your Life. This electrifying track is an explosion of energy from start to finish, with its pulsating beats, infectious rhythm, and irresistible hooks. From the moment those opening chords hit, you can't help but feel the urge to dance like nobody's watching. The song's message of embracing excitement, seizing the moment, and living life to the fullest resonates deeply with me, making it an instant mood booster whenever it comes on. But what really sets Spice Up Your Life apart for me is its undeniable cha-cha potential. I told you I like Latin dancing. There's just something about the rhythm and tempo that just begs for a little salsa-inspired footwork. Spice Up Your Life is my go-to song for letting loose and having a blast. All right, next, let's delve into one of the Spice Girls' most iconic hits, Wannabe. This infectious track is not just a song, it's a cultural phenomenon. From its catchy melody to its playful lyrics, Wannabe captures the essence of friendship, empowerment, and living life to the fullest. The moment those opening beats kick in, you can't help but feel a surge of energy and excitement. What makes Wannabe one of my all-time favorites is its irresistibly catchy nature and its ability to make me smile no matter what. But beyond its infectious melody, I also connect deeply with the song's message. Its themes of loyalty, camaraderie, and the importance of genuine connections resonate with me on a personal level. Whether I'm singing along with friends or belting out the lyrics on my own, Wannabe never fails to lift my spirits and remind me of the power of friendship. Now let's dive into the ethereal beauty of Viva Forever by the Spice Girls. This enchanting ballad is a departure from the group's usual high-energy pop anthems, yet it remains one of their most captivating and hauntingly beautiful songs. From the moment the haunting melody begins to weave its spell, you're transported to a world of dreams and longing. The lush instrumentation combined with the Spice Girls' soulful harmonies creates a mesmerizing atmosphere that tugs at the heartstrings. What makes Viva Forever one of my personal favorites is its sheer beauty and emotional depth. The lyrics speak of love, loss, and the bittersweet passage of time, evoking a sense of nostalgia and yearning that resonates deeply with me. 
whether I'm feeling introspective or simply in need of a moment of quiet reflection. Viva Forever never fails to soothe my soul and transport me to a place of peace and tranquility. Okay, let's wrap up our Spice Girls song journey with a playful twist as we dive into The Lady is a Tramp. This delightful track showcases the Spice Girls' fun-loving spirit and their ability to inject humor into their music. From its cheeky lyrics to its upbeat tempo, The Lady is a Tramp never fails to bring a smile to my face and a chuckle to my lips. The song's playful portrayal of a rebellious and independent woman who defies societal norms is both refreshing and empowering. What makes The Lady is a Tramp one of my favorites is its ability to make me laugh and lift my spirits every time I hear it. Whether I'm in need of a pick-me-up or simply looking for a good laugh, this song never fails to deliver. So, as we wrap up our exploration of my favorite Spice Girls songs, I must confess, choosing just a handful was not an easy feat. While I adore every Spice Girls track for their infectious energy, empowering messages, and sheer fun, these are the ones that hold a special place in my heart and bring a smile to my face every time I hear them. And before I go on to the next section, I can't forget to give a special shout out to the song Mama, a touching tribute to the strong, loving women in our lives. This song holds a particularly dear spot in my heart as it reminds me of my own incredible mom. I'll never forget the Mother's Day when I played it for her, using music to express the depth of my gratitude and love. And to my wonderful mom, if you're listening to this episode, which I know you will eventually, let this be a reminder, I promise to play Mama for you again soon, because I know it holds a special place in both our hearts, although you probably forgot you heard it. But I will remind you, just remind me after you hear this episode that I need to play the song Mama for you. Thank you, Mom, for being a rock in my life and for always supporting me, even when I express myself through music. And here's to the Spice Girls for providing the soundtrack to so many unforgettable moments, both big and small. Zigga zigga. Before we wrap up this Spice-filled episode, let's take a moment to reflect on the lasting legacy of the Spice Girls in the music industry and popular culture. These fierce femmes didn't just make music, they made history, leaving an indelible mark on the world that continues to inspire and empower generations. From their infectious tunes to their iconic personas, the Spice Girls weren't just a pop sensation, they were a cultural phenomenon. They brought girl power to the forefront, encouraging fans around the world to embrace their individuality, stand up for what they believe in, and celebrate the bonds of friendship. They brought girl power to the forefront, encouraging fans around the world to embrace their individuality, stand up for what they believe in, and celebrate the bonds of friendship. Whether you were a scary, sporty, baby, ginger, or posh, there was a Spice Girl for everyone to identify with and look up to. But their influence didn't stop there. The Spice Girls paved the way for subsequent generations of artists and pop culture icons, inspiring a new wave of girl groups and empowering individuals to break free from societal norms and express themselves authentically. From Destiny's Child to Little Mix, the impact of the Spice Girls can be seen in the music, fashion, and attitude of countless artists who followed in their fabulous footsteps. And let's not forget about their trailblazing approach to feminism, empowerment, and LGBTQ plus representation. The Spice Girls weren't just singing about girl power, they were living it. They championed equality, diversity, and inclusivity breaking down barriers and challenging stereotypes at every turn. Whether they were advocating for LGBTQ plus rights or standing up against sexism in the music industry, the Spice Girls were unapologetic in their pursuit of a more inclusive and empowered world. So, as we raise our girl power flags high and sing along to spice up your life for the upteenth time, Let's celebrate the Spice Girls for the trailblazers, trendsetters, and icons they truly are. Their legacy will forever be etched in the history of music, reminding us all to spice up our lives and embrace the power of unity, diversity, and above all, girl power. Since the Spice Girls burst onto the scene in the 90s, they've held a special place in my heart, 
and that love has only grown stronger over the years. But delving into their music and memories for this episode has reignited my passion for this iconic girl group like never before. In fact, it's safe to say I'm now more obsessed with them than ever. From reliving their greatest hits to scouring the internet for rare videos and memorabilia, I'm ready to fully embrace my Spice Girls fandom once again. Their infectious energy, empowering messages, and timeless tunes continue to inspire me. And I'm grateful for the opportunity to share my love for this incredible group with all of you. So, here's to the Spice Girls, the ultimate girl group, and to all the fans who've danced, sung, and zigazig odd along with them. Thank you for joining me on this journey through my favorite girl group, and I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. And with that, we've reached the end of our Spice Girls extravaganza. But fear not, fellow Spice fans, for the girl power never truly fades away. So dust off those platform shoes, crank up the tunes, and get ready to spice up your life like never before. And hey, if you're anything like me and find yourself craving more musical adventures, then make sure to tune in next week for another jam-packed episode filled with even more music magic. Until then, keep grooving, keep rocking, and above all, keep spreading the good old girl power. Peace out, everybody. This has been the Music in Me podcast. Subscribe now so you don't miss a beat.